My name is Kurt Long. I work on NASA's X-59. I'm an aerospace engineer. My main job is to help design, develop, and test the pilot's life support system, the oxygen that the pilot's going to breathe while we fly. I also help out a little bit with flight test planning and execution once the aircraft is built. So many people don't know in the ejection seat for the X-59, it has to sustain the pilot in the unlikely event that the pilot has to eject. If you eject at a high altitude, the pilot's going to fall for five or six minutes before they get down to an altitude where they can breathe. So we have to make sure there's enough emergency oxygen contained within the seat so the pilot can breathe the whole way down. I am a mentor and I do get to work with a lot of really talented students. I think a lot of students are drawn to X-59 because it does represent the future. And I think it's a lot of hands-on work. This is a real aircraft that's really gonna exist. And the students, they see that, hey, I actually can have an absolute say in the development of a truly, truly game-changing bit of technology. When I'm not working, I do like to take vacations that sort of go a little bit more extreme. And in particular, I go on vacation to collect stories. I'm a big fan of life is all about collecting stories, going and trying things that are a little bit outside your comfort zone because it teaches you a little bit about yourself and makes you more confident to go do other things as well. I love a lot of outdoor activities. Most every one of them relates to either wind or water. I like flying gliders. I like sailing. I sail an awful lot. Aviation safety in general, both commercial and military, has, has improved tremendously, leaps and bounds in the three or more decades that I've been working in aviation. We have lowest accident rates today than have ever been in existence. With X-59, we plan on keeping those accident rates incredibly, incredibly low. Non-existent is what we're shooting for, and I think we're just about there. Here we are getting very close to X-59's first flight. I know myself and everybody else is gonna be really excited that day when we see it actually, uh, the wheels leave the ground. Looking forward to it.